all signs. I'm just going to pull a card for each of the sign. And this is what your person wants to tell you today. Okay. <laughs> and this is, this may be just their energy today. Okay. Uh, yeah. Some of it could be general, but we'll see. Uh, maybe I'll pull two cards if I'm uncertain, but yeah. But Virgo, we're going to go ahead and start with Aries. We're going to start with Aries. Let's see. So if you're dealing with an Aries, this is what your person has to say to you. Here, oh wow, it says that they are going to be keeping things light with you. I do feel like you are dealing with someone who's very flirtatious though, just FYI. Okay, your person is very flirtatious. And if this is someone new, I do see that there is going to be an Aries in your life who's going to be flirting with you, but just be careful. They have a tendency to be very flirty, okay, with people in general. Um, if you are dealing, I'm sorry, let me go back to the Zodiac. If you're dealing with a Taurus, this is what your person wants to say to you here, Virgo. Bullseye, you are their target. You are center of attention. You are their focus, okay? And it says they will not fail, <laughs> okay? So if you're dealing with a Taurus, this person has their eye on you, all right, if you are dealing with a Gemini, this is what the Gemini wants to say to you. While this looks like this has been an on and off again thing, <laughs> I'm just going to be honest with you. You guys are going in circles and I feel like you're, you and your person both feel like you guys are wasting time. You're wasting each other's time. If you're dealing with a Cancer, let's see what's going to come out here if you're dealing with a Cancer. Uh, both of you guys have a choice. This is not really serious. It basically talks about other people are involved here. And if that's been an issue, it's still going to continue to be an issue that other people are going to be involved, whether it's on your end or your person's end. If you are a Leo for today, this person has to tell you what? Um, that they want to put forth some effort, okay? Um, this is basically what they're saying. They want to water this a little bit and see how it will grow, okay? Um, this is for today, <laughs> okay? Because some of you guys, I know for a fact, dealing with a Leo has been crazy, but it says you have to have patience with them, okay? Just telling you. If you're a Virgo dealing with another Virgo, they're comfortable. They're not really moving, okay? They feel a little safe, all right? Um, but the only thing is about comfortability, it doesn't necessarily mean that it is right, but you guys will find out in time anyway, okay? I do feel like there's an immaturity with this too. Somebody is a little immature, just FYI. If you are Virgo dealing with a Libra, they're going to be calling you. If you haven't talked to them, there's going to be some type of message that's going to come in for you and they're going to tell you something. Whatever that is, it's meant for you. If you are a Virgo dealing with a Scorpio, this Scorpio really likes you. They admire you a lot, but just be careful because this could be a little bit of a, uh, what is this called? Uh, um, love bombing kind of energy. They romanticize a lot. So, you know, it's like they'll like you a lot in the beginning, but at the same time, it can, it can be very fleeting. I don't know why I felt that way with that Scorpio, but that's what I feel when I see that Scorpio card. When it says put on a pedestal, so, yeah, they're going to treat you very well, but then it can also knock you down very quickly. All right, so if you are a Virgo dealing with Sagittarius, um, this there's a breaking point here. Yeah, I feel like somebody feels like they're stepping on eggshells or um, just in general, the situation is just not nice. I feel like, like it says here, it's a delicate situation. Uh, someone feel, feel is in fear of upsetting, ups, get it together. <laughs> Someone is in fear of upsetting the other person. And I don't like that energy when you feel like, oh my God, I can't say something because I'm scared I'm going to make them mad. Uh-uh. But that's what I'm seeing here with the Sagittarius. So it doesn't necessarily look like it's the best connection here. If you are a Virgo dealing with a Capricorn, uh, I feel like they want to take this to the next level, to be honest with you. It says up the ladder. For some of you, this person wants to take it to the next level, which makes sense for some Capricorns. Their energy is very much so wanting a committed relationship as well. Not everybody, but for some. If you're a Virgo dealing with a dealing with an Aquarius, okay. Well, it says there's going to be some changes. Okay, could be good changes. All right, um, but I do see that there's going to be some good changes with this one. I feel like it'll be better. Okay, um, if you've been dealing with Aquarius where there's been some problems, they want to change. They may want to change. Okay. Last person here, if you're dealing with a Pisces. Oh, erratic behavior, a lot of foolishness, 
A lot of foolishness. <laughs> That's the only thing I got to say. This is what I have for you, Virgo, here with the all signs for today. I will try to do this as often as possible. All right, bye, guys.